on. You, you're not listening to me. Yes, I am. You've told me your name is Michael Thompson and you're not with your National Guard unit. So, Mike, why do you expect to receive your National Guard pay? I'm sort of with the regular army now, and we're up in the mountains fighting, but... Are you actually in the regular army? Not officially. I, I kind of got swept up during the retreat from Seattle. Then have your company clerk file a 451-A. Look, our company clerk got his head blown off two hours ago. I need that money, and I need it sent to my ex-wife in Chicago before she... Mike, Mike, I can only pay you... ...or an actual current spouse. That is if I could even pay you, which I can't unless I get a 451-A. For the ex-spouse, I'm going to need a declaration from a court. A declaration from the court? <laughs> have, have you heard? We've been invaded. <sighs> that doesn't change anything. We have rules in this country for a reason. And if I, we... I swear, I, I'm, I'm going to beat these damn Russians, and, and then I, I, I'm going to hunt you down. How do you like that? Yeah, hunt me down with a 451A. And I need it in triplicate, Corporal. After Pine Valley, the Russians pulled back and tightened their perimeter around Seattle. Unable to mount an attack ourselves, we waited, nursing our wounds and trying to anticipate what would happen next. Not long before Christmas, the Russians made their next move. Several regiments attacked east up into the Cascade Range, and it soon became apparent that their objective was Fort Teller, the headquarters for the Strategic Defense Initiative, or as the public popularly dubbed it, the Star Wars Project. What we knew, and they didn't, was that the project was a bust. If the Russians reached the base, they'd realize the whole thing was basically a scam, that we had nothing to stop their nuclear missiles from striking our cities and military bases. We couldn't let them figure that out, so we moved east as well, taking the fight into the mountains and trying to delay the Russians while Colonel Wilkins and his people at Fort Teller dug in as hard as they could. Oh, maybe it's not a Russian mission. I thought it was. I suggest we fortify these crossings and then blow up the bridge. Yeah, that should buy Wilkins some time. That won't work, sir. We don't have nearly enough And men. what you have us do? Roll over and die? If Ivan gets to Fort Teller, we'll have a global thermonuclear war in our hands. Hey, must be a Russian scout. Damn it! We need to get moving. You won't be needed here, Bannon. I'm sending you 10 miles northeast on a recon mission. Understood, sir. All right, then. Wilkins is counting on us. Let's get to it. I like how they kicked up that. It's just two branches in, like, a rock or no something. No time to dick around, Parker. Establish defensive positions at those two forts. Will do. Maybe, if unless I, I fail. already there, I want him annihilated. You hear me? If he gets the chance to dig in before we get there, we won't be able to hold back the main force. Indeed. Must be quick, which I'm not good at. You're unaware. Let's get Try some. Quick, the sooner we dig in, the better. Captain Webb is standing by to reinforce. Let's get six you. of those. Now get going. Eagle six out. Uh, I don't know. We get eight of those. Colonel, these woods are ideal for infantry. The trees could cover in advance almost all the way to the river. I can only get You're one. right, Captain. Using the woods would help us that retain the element of surprise. That gives me an odd number of those. Eh. Parker, use those woods as cover for your infantry as you maneuver toward the river. Try to take Ivan by surprise. I like how I'm going to take him by surprise, but I drop my dudes from a freaking plane that could be seen from quite some time away. Look, there it goes. In fact, my, dude, my actual infantry apparently come from space, because apparently they don't come on the plane, which whatever. Do what you want, I suppose. Let's get you guys out of the way so I can select my infantry here. I think I'm going to have... My infantry stick together. Which means I'm probably going to have my armor on their own way over here, which is not necessarily optimal. But I think if any point could be held by infantry, actually... We got a nice foresty area right there that would actually be much better for infantry. Ready for duty. Infantry moving. We're gonna sprint to the target. Since they're already over here, we're gonna just try and I guess. Set up that machine gun. Hopefully we can kill this group of riflemen before they actually get in the building, otherwise we're gonna have riflemen in a building to deal with. Apparently they're unable to kill. 
Oh, apparently they're unable to carry out that order. Why are you not shooting them? God dang it. We're marching to that perimeter. Oh, there's freaking... Freaking tanks over here. You get him killed. We need both of these crossings held. Unfortunately. I think we're going to go ahead and tell these guys to sprint over here, which is going to be a heck of a long run. Why is he not dead? Alright, well. Get into position. You fire him, and then go back over there. Go. Get you over there. Go ahead and start building our defenses on this side while these guys very slowly run all the way across the map because I'm an idiot apparently. Are you guys going to be able to hold this freaking place? That you do need orders. Oh, there's a freaking... Medium tank over there. That's always a good sign. Can you guys see we're already sprinting? Already sprinted. We're going to lose this tank here. Unfortunately, I can't tell him to move. Oh, he's still alive. Because we don't have a we don't have any defenses built on that point yet, so if he goes anywhere and there's an enemy on that point, then we're gonna lose the point. Time left on secondary. Let's get a couple airstrikes over here. Clear out those points. Moving out. Running is ordered. Get these guys set up to hopefully start dealing with this stuff. Please kill him before he runs you. Well, the great the trees are on fire again. That's my favorite activity, is watching the trees burn. I didn't do much to the target area. I don't know what you're on about. You guys are having some issues over there. We do finally have some defenses built over here. So let's get our tanks going this way, because well apparently done, my infantry needs some help because all their trees burnt down. Oh yeah, I'm aware of the resistance. And my scouts report increased Soviet activity across the river. They're moving fast. It's getting position. We to move faster. You know what to do, Parker. Eagle I do know out. what to do. Thank you. Can you guys shoot him, please? Can you guys shoot something? I don't care what you do, just shoot something. Where are my tanks at? There they are. There's my ally, finally. You're gonna get run over by the freaking Humvee when you have missile launchers? Thank you. Eagle Six, come in! This is Bannon! Bannon, report! We're two clicks from our final waypoint and engaging a small Soviet advance force. APCs and Jeeps, over! Let's basically do what we did before, but we're gonna keep my wounded guy in the back here. Oh, we got more stuff. I want you to destroy it. Report when you're done. Eagle six out. Probably is my infantry. So wait, let's get one of you, one of you, and then we need to see. Actually, before I even do that, what the heck is shooting my dudes? Oh, there's dudes in the forest. Oh, I should have expected that, I suppose. That's way too close to be shooting machine guns here, or uh, grenade launchers here. I should be able to handle it because they've got into infantry. Let's get you guys reinforced and see what we can afford. One of you? Is that it? Apparently just one of you. I know, we'll soon be able to afford that. Hold on. I think that tank's gonna die here shortly. I have a distinct feeling of this possibility. Pop some smoke. Just give him some defense. You... Is there anywhere I can drop these a little closer? No, because I don't have this point held. Screw it, drop there. Don't care. We need to get these tanks Swift. repaired, we're otherwise we're going to lose them, and they've got experience. Roger that, Webb. Keep them at bay. Eagle six out. Good job, Webb. Once these defenses are built, I think it'll only let us build one. Maybe it'll let us build more this time. It only let us build one on that side. Driving quick, ready to drive. Another excellent oh, there job, it goes. Parker. I'm detailing a pair of M60s to you. Don't lose them. They're M60s. all we have until Bannon returns. Can I drop these returns. over here? I can. 
Armor and facing. This is the thing that tells you about armor. I've basically already told this. There's frontal, side, and rear armor in this game. Web here. My men are reinforcing the second crossing now. And sir, I'm sure Bannon will pull through. That remains to be seen, Captain. Let's get these guys repaired as soon as we can. I should have bought a second we'll repair capable boards, vehicle. Parker. Move on to your next objective. And now for the final crossing, Parker. The bridge is the prize. Claim it and secure it before Ivan does. It's all the way over there. I apparently should have done this in the opposite order that I was doing it in. Who would have known? Probably someone who's already played this before. Eagle Six, this Sprint. is Bannon. Sit rep, over. Where is my Roger dude? That, Bannon. I gather you didn't accomplish your objective. The bridge has been destroyed, sir. We're moving back now, but we're encountering increased Soviet resistance. Good job, in the area. Bannon. We you. won't be able to hold the crossing Go. forever, Bannon. If you're not here in time, you'll have to find another way around. But sir, the area's crawling with commies. Yeah, and yeah, I yeah. Care we less, will. Bannon. Ivan is not getting this bridge because of your incompetence. Eagle Six out. This Sawyer guy, he's got he's got no time for for Bannon's anything at this point in the game, apparently. Let's get you guys going over there as soon as we can. Same with you. Sprint to the target, sir, if you can. You guys need to go as well. I was just waiting for them to repair as best we can, but we can't hang out here because stuff is happening and we have an objective over here. Which, if that turns red, I know. Understood, Captain. What was the purpose of that? I mean, it removes the trees, so you can't hide in them. So backup would be nice, though. We Roger should do that, some I'll area recon. Do. Eagle six out. I was going to say, as soon as that turns red, I'm going to start bombing that area, but considering we have aerial recon, we may as well use that. I should have got these guys a freaking transport, Jesus. Apparently that was a thing I should have done. There's nothing here? What the heck did you bomb that for, then? Whatever. Web. How are you holding out? You're being shot at. You need to stop being shot at, please. The Russians are attacking like they crazy, will swim, by the way. For a while longer. I am running low on ammo, though. Infantry is capable Roger of swimming across rivers, which is nice, supplies. actually. Hang in there. Eagle six out. They also leave little... For whatever reason, uh... Infantry behave very much like vehicles. They leave tread marks, as you can see there. I think it's just a, a means that they did this for snow, but if you go from snow to road, it'll actually continue leaving the mark for a little bit, so it looks like they're very heavy people. Let's get you guys over Sir, there. Have we heard from Colonel Wilkins yet? I, so. I spoke to him oh, briefly in That would explain why they shot at us, apparently. Bombs, the garrison town near Fort Teller. Let me shoot him. Thank you. How many men does he have? Two understrength you. companies is what he told me, Captain. Two understrength and companies. We have regiments you. of Soviet troops coming. This won't be an easy fight, Colonel. Really should no longer no, be here. Flee! Captain. It won't. We should easily be able to handle this without infantry, although I wish they were over here. They're currently being actively murdered, so I'm trying to get them into the trees here. You need to shoot that or they're gonna run you over. Alright, time to leave! I lost a unit. Must have been infantry. Uh, Webb's got a heck of a fight going on over here, on both sides, and he's not handling it very well on that one. Troops are ready for action. Did kind of screw him over to be fair, but details. Do I have any airdrops? No, we just got recon, which I don't care about recon right now. Especially since this forward line already has both of the defenses built because there's so much crap over there. Sprint, please. I'll reinforce them in a moment. I actually want to stuff them in those trees, and then we'll reinforce them. Even though sticking them all here, as you can see, having a bunch of people here makes this stuff build really fast, so... In fact, just them running through almost allowed that to complete. Stay zoomed in so we can watch how slow it is now. It's that poor Humvee crew having to build. Once they're in the trees over here, I'll reinforce them. I'm assuming I won't need to move from this point anytime soon, so. Good job, Parker. We'll Good wait a job. little while longer. But if Bannon isn't here soon, we'll blow the bridge. They're freaking infantry coming from behind me. What is this crap? That's cheating. And there's infantry in the trees. That is also technically cheating. Parker, 
The weather is getting worse, and the Air Force says they soon won't be able to bring in any more reinforcements. Call in what you can before their planes are grounded. Well, this is all I'm going to be able to afford, so... Reinforcement airdrops away in one minute. I mean, the weather looks fine, and it certainly doesn't look like it's going to get worse anytime soon, so I don't know what they're on about. That's a weird place for a machine gun emplacement. Also, we've lost one of the crossings already. Good lord, look at this crap. Also, watch the AI drive this stuff behind things like an idiot. Whatever. Ah, uh, it's fine. All we have to do is hold the bridge. Uh, you can't actually... There goes that house. Once Last you... Last call for those reinforcements, yeah, yeah, yeah. Once you capture the crossings, I don't think it's possible to fail anything involving them because you've already done it, so... Unfortunately, we have straight up completely lost that crossing, so... All we've got is that one right there and this bridge, and the enemy has a whole bunch of crap over there. I could help him, I mean... I just got off the horn with the we, air force. We could call in Their some artillery grounded, or something. And that means no more reinforcements. We'll have to make do with what we've got. Eagle Six out. Let's call in a bunch of light artillery over here. Sir, should have been doing that the whole time, but whatever. Soviet artillery vehicles moving into position oh, good. the river. Roger that. They'll be zeroing in on your position, Parker. Send out a strike team to neutralize them. Will do. Probably with light tanks. Light artillery is really bad against vehicles, by the way. Where are my light tanks? Let's go, buddies. That is a interesting path, considering there's a road right Eagle there. Six. I have a sit rep. Whatever. My scouts say the Soviet main force is moving into the area. We need to blow that bridge. Bannon, come if we start seeing a bunch of... Where the hell of... are you? Charlie Six, yeah, yeah, yeah. Knocked over tree, god dang it. If we start seeing a bunch sir. of enemies, we and should probably use infantry for this. But for now, we're going to try and quickly time. rush over here with Damn my light tanks. If I don't hear from them soon, we'll blow the bridge and move on. I think they're just shooting at my tanks, which is fine. Hello. Hello. How's it going? Web here. The Russians are coming at us in force. Bring up those Gustavs and we'll show those bastards Bring up the what? You what? Good job clearing right. the artillery. Let's get these guys back down here. Now Basically the same way they came. Around the bridge. It's not going well on that side of the map. My side of the map is perfectly fine, though. We've got absolutely nothing happening over here. Could call in some heavy artillery over here, just for the points, because otherwise it does nothing. You have literally lost your entire military force, like, several times over so far, Webb. Don't worry about it. I'm going to preemptively move my light tanks back here. There's really no need for them to be up on the front lines, considering how weak their armor actually is. The medium tanks, they don't have great armor. Certainly better than light tanks, though. Oh, look, it's very cloudy now. Suddenly clouds. Captain Webb, Traders rep. look weird in the snow. Webb here. We're still holding at the fords, but the Russians will break through eventually. Their main force can't be far out now. I mean, if you want to be technical, Captain, we'll he already did break through that possible, one. But I won't risk it for Bannon's sake. He'll have to fend for himself if he's late. Sir, we will need his tanks for the upcoming battle. Indeed we will. Maybe. If we lose this bridge, there won't be any more battles. Webb knows what's up. We do actually need his tanks, considering he's the only one capable of using heavy tanks for the vast majority of the missions here. And once again, we've completely lost this crossing. Falling slightly forward, even though I'm going to end up hitting my own teammates' vehicles. Whatever, it's fine. It's not like it actually counts for anything, and I'm getting free points. It did, including friendly dust. Let's go back to our bridge, even though nothing ever happens over here. There's zero chance the AI will get into this position, primarily because of this infantry death zone that is right in front of it. Take this light tank, for instance. Coming along, oh, no, never mind, it's dead. Anti-tank infantry is really powerful, especially if you get them into some trees, because they'll just wreck stuff. Like so. Plus, they can fire at many different targets simultaneously if they feel like it, including targets complete opposite sides of one person. That single person will shoot at both of them. Don't ask questions. 
It's fine. Oh, hey, we need to leave, don't we? Like, it's time to sprint, I feel, because that is a lot of crap. Go ahead and clean that up, get our medium tanks ready to reverse across the bridge here in a second. You get out of the way. In fact, we're going to lose that medium tank in a second here. Unfortunately, yep, yeah, there it goes. I wish I hadn't lost them, but whatever. We can't delay any longer. They might be dead for all we know. Prepare to blow the bridge and move, Parker. I've already moved. Should I not have already moved? Maybe I shouldn't. Oh no, there's Ben. Hi, Ben. Six. Eagle Six, this is Bannon. Don't blow the bridge yet. We're half a click out and coming up on the rear of several Soviet tanks. Apparently, I shouldn't blow the bridge yet. Belay that order, Parker. Don't blow the bridge yet. Hold until Charlie Company is across. We'll do. Let's get our light tanks in there. They're a little cheaper. Just lost, Parker. Not that I can replace anything anymore. I'm gonna take it back. Don't worry. Bannon decided to show up, and I forgot he does at that point. It's fine. Apparently, I should have just left my infantry up there, and they would have been able to hold that easily and moved my medium tanks back earlier. Oh that well. That was in the nick of time, Bannon. Well done. Well done. Thank you, sir. In the meantime, right, we've completely everyone. lost We're that moving fort. moving on to Cascade Falls. Stay sharp. This thing ain't over yet. Yeah, we've lost both of the crossings. Webb had one job. Actually, had like a whole bunch of jobs. But he failed all of them. We did a thing. That was a really short mission. He says, as it was 20 minutes long. I think the next US mission is the one that I really like in terms of story stuff. So, I don't know if it's the next mission or not. But it is the next US mission, I believe. Either way, thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next time.